Anthony, you got a package from Amazon? Seems like it's a coffee machine. Another coffee machine? That's the eighth one this hour. Why are you ordering so many coffee machines? I'm not. Yeah, all of these random packages are showing up at our doorstep, and I got a guitar. So you guys are just getting all this stuff for free? Yeah, we don't know what to do with it. I think I've got an idea. We'll take everything that you guys are getting, and we'll sell it for profit. So, like, become our own Amazon? Exactly. This house will be our warehouse, we don't have to spend any money on products, and Toph will be our driver. I don't have my license. You can borrow mine. That's perfect. We look identical. I can build us the website. I think this might work. Great. Let's do it. Oh, thank you for shopping at Amazon too, sir. Oh, you're trash! No, not trash. Your package. No, I ordered trash. It's from a collection of trash. If you want to come back to my house, I'll show it to you. No, I have like so many packages, sir. I have to go. Bye. Oh, have fun. Why are you bringing trash into my room? This isn't trash. This is all the money we made. Bring in the trash. Here's your package, sir. Thank you for shopping with Amazon too. Uh, wait. Ma! Ma, your new rash scrubber is here! Uh, sir, do you mind coming in and giving her a scrub for me? They don't pay me enough for this. Uh, what horrible service. Amazon One always scrubs my mother. So what do you think of this yacht? Uh, you know what's good? But what if I told you we have another bag of money? <laughs> yeah, I'm getting the one with the water slide. <laughs> Wait. Don't you think that instead of buying this expensive yacht, we should give Tove more money? Nah. What is this address? This isn't even a house. Wait! <laughs> Sir, your package? Oh, thank goodness. I thought you were a hitman. Uh, but either way, my package is late. Well, I'm the only driver, and you're in the middle of nowhere. Well, I did not want my parents to see that I was ordering more Robux. Fair point. I've been there before. Here's your package. I really have to go. Okay. Thank you. Bye, hitman! Check it out. Our new $40 billion mansion. It's nice, but don't you think something looks a little off about it? Yeah, you know, you're right. It almost looks like we can't go over there. Yeah, like, it, like it's like a stock image or something? Yeah, maybe we should just go back to your normal house. Wait, you think that we should hire more drivers to help Toph? I'm sure he's fine. Breaking news! Amazon 2 has just surpassed Amazon 1 as the best delivery service in the entire world. We did it? Rumor has it that multi-billionaire supreme leader of Amazon, Jeff Bezos, is not happy. Oh, I would not want to be those guys over on Amazon 2. Huh. Uh, okay, well, good thing that's not us. That is us. I know. Well, what's the worst that can happen? Look what we got, another free package from Amazon to sell. Open it up, let's see what we've got. What is this? Uh, I don't mean to freak you out, but I think that might be a bomb. Why would you think that? Because that's a bomb. Oh. What do we do? Well, don't hold on to it. Right. Why would you give it to me? <gasps> what am I supposed to do? Throw it out the door. Right. Oh, hello, trash. <gasps> More trash! Yeah! Oh, wait, this is a bomb! <laughs> uh, oops. Okay, dude, why would Amazon say that's a bomb? Oh my god. The news report! Jeff Bezos, Supreme Leader, Dark Lord of Amazon, must be trying to kill us because we stole his business! <laughs> okay, maybe that wasn't Jeff Bezos that sent us the bomb, and maybe it was somebody else! Okay, yeah, yeah, that's, that's a good point. That's a really fair point. It, it could have been anybody. And in that case, uh, someone still sent us a bomb. Well, it could have been an accident. Oh, I just had the worst week. How do you accidentally send someone a bomb? I don't know. I don't work for the post office. I said I just had the worst week. Oh, what, Seth? Oh. I'm sorry, I didn't know you overheard, but uh, I just had a terrible week. Worse than getting a bomb delivered to your doorstep? Way worse than that. I just got a new job at Amazon. Oh, that's great, maybe you can help us. Wait, let me finish. Anyways, the job description said that I was gonna be a delivery man, right? Then I met Jeff Bezos, Jeff and Jeff, and he told me I was gonna be assassinating people or something? What? what? Yep, so now I gotta kill you guys. This wouldn't have been so personal if you let the bomb go off. Wait. It's us that you were told to assassinate? You're the one who left us the bomb? Yeah, I think that's pretty obvious at this point. So, 
kind of new to this. Which one of you guys wants to go first? Run, run, run! No, 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 please, please! Oh, terrible at the chase part! <gasps> Don't close it! Ah! Okay, what do we do? Are you able to delete the site? Of course I built it! Okay, I think we made enough money to live off of, so let's just delete the site, that way Jeff Bezos has no reason to kill us anymore! Okay, let's do it. Okay, all right. Uh... Why did it make that noise? Uh, it's fine. I think I just put in the password wrong. Why did it make the noise again? Okay, so I don't remember the password to our site. How do you not remember the password you made the site yesterday? It's fine, because... I know someone, actually, who can hack in for us. <laughs> oh, so excited. I think I hear people. What? Listen, I didn't want to say that I knew, but I knew. I know about the surprise party. Why would there be a surprise party? Okay, you guys are really dragging this on. I know, I'm gonna take off this blindfold and everyone's gonna jump out at me. Where is everyone? Why do you keep thinking there's a surprise party? Because it's my freaking birthday. Oh. Okay, so we need you to help us with something. Oh, okay, so you forget my birthday, but now you need favors. Yes, yeah, so we forgot the password to a website and we're gonna need you to hack in and take it down. Fine. Fine, I'll do it, right? I'll do it. But you have to get me a cake and you have to sing happy birthday. <sighs> okay, fine, I'll get you a cake. You two go upstairs, get started with the site. I'll be back. This is officially my third worst birthday. <sighs> Drive, tiny boy. Seth? Don't do anything stupid. <laughs> Too late! I ripped out every wire I could find in this car. The doors won't open, the windows won't open, this car won't even drive! So now, you're gonna drive me to Jeffy Jeff Bezos' house so I can collect my $10 an hour, or else I'm gonna kill your brother. Playing fall, guys. Seth, you said it yourself. How am I supposed to drive you to Jeffy Jeff if the car won't drive? How much do you think an Uber would be? You also locked us in the car. Yeah, and there's also a heat wave today. We're gonna die in here! Not if we blow on each other. No, like, I'm gonna blow on you, you're gonna blow on Anthony, and then Anthony will blow on me. And then I'll keep us cool. And the air will circulate around the car. Um, okay. Yeah. yeah. Can you maybe, I don't know, get started? Oh, I'll get started. All right, look, I get it. We forgot your birthday, but can you please just help us? Our lives are on the line. Do you know why I'm wearing the suit, Ryan? No. I've worn this exact suit every year for my birthday since I was four, okay? And you led me in here blindfolded for some big surprise, and this is it. You blindfolded yourself! Because it's my freaking birthday! Where's Anthony with my cake? <laughs> Seth, can I have the not broken controller? No, no, I chewed on that one for a reason. Right. <gasps> I forgot! I have my phone! Hello? Hey, it's uh, Feeny. Listen, I'm trapped in the car in the middle of a heat wave. Seth stole my wires, nothing is working, and they're playing games. Jeff Bezos is trying to kill me. Sure, um, but where's my cake? Did you not hear me? Yeah, yeah, I heard everything you said. Yeah, and you expect me to believe it? On my birthday? <sighs> Let me talk to him. Hello? Hey, Feeny. Yeah, no, I know, I sent you a birthday text, right? All right, see you later. Hello? Seth remembered my birthday. You're not understanding the situation. Please call for help. Uh, hello? Huh? Huh? My phone died. Ryan, he hung up on me. Can you believe this? Do you know what day it is? <sighs> yes, your birthday. No, it's my freaking birthday. I'm going to die before I get to experience my yacht. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You bought a yacht? Did I say yacht? I meant tooth brush. He said toothbrush. No, he meant yeah. The money had to go somewhere. I am your only driver. I have been working my butt. Uh, his butt. Uh, can we stop talking about his butt? Well, if you don't want to talk about his butt, we can talk about my butt, your butt. We can kind of like, you know, take turns. How about we talk about the yacht? The yacht? Oh, so is your yacht. 
I sunk that. You what? First thing Jeff Bezos said to do was sink the victim's yacht. Second thing he said to do was take all of his clothes, throw them in the mud. Third thing he said to do is take them out of the mud. What are you doing? Fine. Since you won't stop asking, I'll just tell you, okay? When I get stressed out, I order packages to Anthony's house. Wait, it's been you ordering those packages to Anthony this whole time? Uh, yeah. It's called a prank. Your idea of a prank is to spend thousands of dollars sending random things to Anthony. Hilarious, right? <sighs> okay, can you please just hack into our site and delete it? Oh, that's right. You forgot your password. Let me pull up your website for you, right? You know what else you forgot? My freaking birthday, which by the way, is today. T-O-D-A-Y, enter. Wait, did you just put in the right password? Uh, yeah. <gasps> There! It's deleted! Jeff Bezos no longer has a reason to kill us! You know, I said I wasn't gonna help you until I got my birthday cake. But, um, you know, you can make it up to me with a birthday kiss. I gotta go tell Anthony! This is officially the second worst birthday I've ever had! 105th thing Jeff Bezos said to do was go to the Bronx Zoo, go to the penguin exhibit, take the 50-gallon drum of chickpeas, dump it <laughs> everywhere. Make sure that chickpeas are just everywhere, that the penguins cannot walk anywhere without stepping in chickpeas. What is happening? Uh, you saved my life! I had to open the door! Well, I grabbed the handle and I pulled it. Wait, but Seth said that he took the wires out of my car and nothing worked. If those weren't my wires, then whose were they? Who took all my wires? How am I supposed to get to my baking class now? If you want to see some bloopers from this video, then you can click the top box on screen. And don't forget to give this video a like, leave us a comment, and subscribe for more videos coming soon. That's about it. We'll see you guys again next week. Bye, guys.